Hi everybody! Welcome to my backyard! I have White Dragon Horse and Horus. And we have been talking a lot about people helpers today. What are people helpers? What do you think? Yeah, exactly! People helpers are people who help people. Yeah. We know lots of them, right? Yeah, I know what, you know, we were thinking about them today because so many people are talking about the important people who are helping us, who are helping us stay safe, who are helping us stay healthy. Um, and Horace thought that there was other people that were helping us. So I asked him and he gave me some really good ideas. I asked White Horse, and he had some good thoughts too. So we wrote down all the people we could think of who were people helpers. And I want to share that list with you. And then when you listen to all the people that we have on our list, maybe you can add people to it that we might have missed. Okay, so I'm just going to put Horace over here. And White Horse, White Dragon Horse. Sorry, guy over here so I can get my list. We wrote them down and I I remembered that so many people like the color orange that I wrote my list in orange. Can you see it there? I'm outside so the sun is not helping me right now. So the list I have, I shouldn't say I, that white dragon horse and horse and I came up with says tree planters, so the people that plant trees, and also the people that plant flowers, so that when we go for walks we can see them, they help our air, they make it fresher. Uh, street cleaners, very important people. If they didn't brush the, the streets and clean the streets, our streets would be yucky, right? Yeah. Oh, I hear an airplane. I don't have them on my list. Pilots! That were the flight attendants who work on the airplanes. You see it going behind me? There it goes. <coughs> Bakers and cooks, so people <coughs> who make our food for us. Animal doctors or veterinarians who look after our animals for us. People doctors who look after us to make sure our bodies are healthy and safe. Grocery store people. Oh my goodness, if we didn't have grocery store people, how would we eat? Where would we buy our food? Bank people. If we didn't have people at the banks who gave us our money, then we wouldn't have money to buy things. Drink makers. So people who make our drinks for us. Um, maybe if we go to the coffee shop. Or if we go to another store where they have special drinks for us, then they make our drinks for us. They're important. Nurses to help us, right? Yeah. Teachers or child care providers, like the teachers at Mongeo, they're very important to us too. The police are people helpers. Firefighters are people helpers. And the ambulance people. They're also on our list because if our bodies are hurt or we're very sick and we have to go to the hospital, they take us there. Have you ever been in an ambulance? I did. It was pretty cool. I hurt my foot and they took me to the hospital. They were very kind and very helpful. People who cut our hair. I need to go see my hair cutter very soon. I can't wait to be able to go see my friend Jane so she can fix my hair for me. Construction people who build our buildings and fix our, our streets. All people that are in construction. Our elevator people. Dan, who fixes the elevator at Mongeo, he's very important. He's a really important people helper to us. Um, bike and car fixers. So the mechanics who make sure our cars work well and our our bikes when we want to ride our bike and even the buses and trains if we didn't have mechanics they wouldn't work so they're a very important people helper book writers 
authors and illustrators like our friend Todd Parr. He's very important. He's a good people helper because they write books for us to help us feel better, right? Yeah. Farmers. Why do you think farmers are so important to us? Yeah, right? They help. But they provide food for us. They grow the grains that make our bread. They grow our vegetables that feed feed us, feed our bodies, and they also ha have um, the grains and things that we feed our the horses and the cows and the chickens. All those things we need farmers for. Door openers, the people who hold doors open, they're helping us and they're making us feel really good in our hearts. So people who help our, our hearts feel good make us feel good, right? They're a good people helper. Um, Garbage, compost, recycling people who pick up all that stuff from us to make our earth clean and fresh and better for us are important people helpers. Can you think of some other ones? Not yet? If you do, send them to me. Okay. The one, I have two more on my list. I don't want you to see the list because I want you to, I want to tell you about them. I think some of the biggest people helpers in our lives today are our family, our mummies and our daddies and grandmas and grandpas, uncles, aunties, who are working very hard to keep us safe. Um, and and their, their hearts are really heavy right now because there's so many big things going on in our world. But without our mummies and daddies, we would be feeling really sad, right? They're very important. And to me, the biggest people helper are you. The ch you children, my friends who, who I get to spend time with every day, except for right now. Um, you are being such a big people helper. You're helping mommy and daddy at home, or you're helping mommy or daddy, um, helping grandmas and grandpas, picking up your toys. Um, just being and, and laughing and ha giving mommy and daddy hugs when they need them. You are such an important people helper. Our world is so great because you are here. We all love you very much. Yeah, so you guys are really important people helpers. And I really encourage you to think of ways that you can be an even bigger helper. What are some things you can do to be kind to other people? to be kind to mom and dad, to auntie and uncle. Maybe you can go and, and send a message, go on, on the computer and, and video chat with somebody. Do you have any other ideas about how you can be kind? Um, yeah, you could draw a picture. That's a great idea. What if you're in your window, you stand in the window and you look outside and you see your neighbor across the street? What could you do to be kind to them? You could wave and a big smile, right? Yeah, that would make them feel so happy. When someone smiles at us, it makes our heart feel so good. So a smile. Mm -hmm. You could draw a picture and put it in your window or I bought some chalk on the weekend. I might try to draw something on my sidewalk. So that when people are walking by, it will make me make them smile. Because we can be good people helpers, right? Yeah. Okay. I can't wait to hear some of your ideas. And remember, if you have made a puppet and you have a picture of it, please send it so I can share it with everybody else. Okay. Have a great rest of your day. Remember that I love you so much, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.